What's up all? So today I'd like to address the motion of the finger control technique in the murder hands exercises. So some people were asking about this and let me kind of give my rundown. So I hold the stick between these two fingers. There's not that much space uh, within between the first and first finger and the thumb. So sue me. And then I try to use the full power of each finger. So rather than like flopping it down here, I try to kind of close it up in there. So you really get the upstroke and it's more similar almost to a wrist stroke in that you really harness the muscles in your forearm. So check it out. This, this is the fulcrum, which is when I say fulcrum, this is what we do. Middle, it's like that. Turn it a little. Ring is like that. Pinky's like that. So at the tempos we do it at, it's in the mid tempo range. And then at faster tempos, you really can harness the power of all fingers. And one thing, I like to keep a space between each finger. So, see it's kind of, so each, the fingers don't touch and interrupt kind of the upswing and control. So, check it out. Notice that the fingers aren't touching, same with the full one. So, that way, you get that sort of range of motion. And mind, mind you, this isn't to a pillow, so if you have that type of dexterity into a pillow, it, uh, it translates well on drums.